After a few months of facing challenges with the Metro Rail Transit 3 or the MRT3's operations, and after the issues regarding the Dalian trains, the DOTR MRT3 announced that they have finally completed the weight testing of the said train. The completion of weight testing, which was preceded by a series of steps, including equipment installation, calibration, weighing of empty trains, and loading of weights, was witnessed by representatives from TUV Rhineland, members of MRT3's joint ADB Australia, 8 Advisory Panel, and DOTR MRT3 Management. The weighing testing was completed by weighing a Dalian car loaded with 1,000 464 sandbags, each weighing 17.5 kilograms to simulate the train's crash capacity of 8 persons per square meter or a total of 394 passengers per car. According to a release statement, the DOTR MRT3 management will only know if the 48 light rail vehicles can be used after the consolidation of reports of the entire audit process, which will be provided and submitted by TUV Rhineland, the independent consultant auditing the trains. Tinimbang so, uh, I think within the week lalabas yun. Uh, ko na lang pangunahan. Uh, alam mo, baka makaroon na erasures dun. Uh, diba? Lalabas so, kung sakto lang, kung sobra, kung sobra, hindi na ba pwedeng mapandar, kung kulang, ano yung dapat gawin. Uh, lahat ho yun lalabas. TUV Rhineland recommended the weight testing in Manila after the previous project team that handled the procurement and delivery of the cars failed to attend and witness the weight testing done in Dalian, China in 2015. DOTR MRT3 is expecting TUV Rhineland to finish and submit its comprehensive and complete report on the audit of Dalian trains in one to two weeks.